Good morning. I hope you're doing well. Today is Christmas. So Merry Christmas. Um, I, and I'm praying for you. I'm praying that your day is full of many blessings and joy. Um, as many of you are finishing up your Christmas Eve today. And um, I pray that you remember the reason that we celebrate Christmas. Um, Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, came to earth as a baby. Um, and that's, that's why we're celebrating it. So, I woke up early, not feeling well. Um, but hopefully I can set that aside and move on and just have a great day. Um, Thomas didn't feel well last Christmas, so I'm really hoping that he feels well today and is just able to enjoy the day and the blessings. And I'm also praying that the kids sleep in because that just makes the day better for us too. So I will show you. So this is what all the Christmas, Christmas stuff looks like. We have been so, so blessed. Family and friends and all these people sent um, just all these gifts in a box and uh, people came together and worked things out so that we were able to get gifts for the twins and um, yeah it's gonna be pretty crazy the twins opened their first gift yesterday kinda they weren't totally for sure of what was going on and what was happening so I got a feeling Thomas will open a lot of their gifts today for them. And there are our stockings. One for Thomas, one for me, one for Daddy, and one for um, Baby H and Baby B. Um, I don't know if we've, I think that's the first time that I've shared their first initial. Um, because they are foster kids, we're not going to share their faces or their names or anything. Um, but you can at least know their first initial. So we have Baby V and Baby H, and they're the cutest. And I'm just so excited to, to get to share Christmas with them and to get to share Christmas with Thomas and Dan. Um, I don't know how much I'll get to film of it. One, I want to enjoy it myself, and two, um, we're really not allowed to, well, we're not allowed to show the girls, so I want to make sure that I don't have a lot of editing and stuff to do, and that I can get this video up um, soon after all the excitement. So, that's it for now, and we'll see you later. Bye. No! I'm gonna go lie down.
Yep. Yep. What else is in your stocking? Daddy. <laughs> Here, play with your toys. Seriously, you just got a bunch of new ones. You don't need to look at your brothers. What a car! Yeah, Red Skull. There's a car! Yep. Yep. Open! See what else is in your sock, bud? Everybody got a bowl of some type. I don't know. Found them at like a Japanese store. Thought it was just fun. He's a diehard Star Wars Lego collector. And he builds all of them. And they all go to his classroom. And his classroom is decorated with them. So I thought those would not, not go to waste. This one is one I had to rescue a little bit ago. My grandma and grandpa's tails. They were partially open because of somebody. Yeah, that happens. It is. What is that? Oh, whetstone. Not exactly the kind of whetstone I was expecting. For knife sharpening. Yeah. Oh, cool. Say thank you. Open. Thomas. Thank you. This is for Thomas from Uncle Daniel and Aunt Britt. Uh -oh. He noticed that it has snow open. on it. Right you open it. You can do it. You're a strong boy. It's a What's this? Oh. The movie. What kind of movie? Wow. What's the movie? Turn it over so mommy can see. What's the movie? I can't see it. Ooh, Monsters, Inc. You'll like that one. Yep. Hey, over, there. over here. Can you say thank you, Thomas? Thomas. Say thank you. Say thank you, Uncle Daniel and Aunt Britt. All right, this is <coughs> from Grandma and Grandpa Scales. You play with your dinosaurs. Whoa, what's that? Oh, yeah. What's that? There we go. What's that? Is that a knife? Multi tool. Multi tool. Wow. 
Those are a big wow. deal. It's a cool one. Daddy, Daddy uses these a lot. Daddy. Right, thank you. Look. That's from Grandma and Grandpa Scales, multi tool. Right. Yeah. Very Angelique. This one's from Grandma and Grandpa. It's got snow on it, Thomas. This is, this is from Grandma and Grandpa, but this one's also for Daddy. It's not for Thomas. It's for Daddy. What is it? Movies? Yes, and, and other things. So, oh, careful, careful. What movie is it? There's a couple, couple movies. Huh? Book. Thomas. A book. A book. It's a sketch pad. A book. A book. Uh huh. Okay. So, so we have Ant Man and the Wasp. Yeah. And Avengers Endgame. Okay. A nice sketch pad. Yeah, that is nice. Then that'll Thank take you a while to look. Great Grandma Grumble Scales or? Grandma Grumble Scales on the label. So, AKA my mom and dad. Could be. Can you need help? Yeah. Okay. help. <laughs> Looks like something daddy had to rewrap. No, this is the original wrapping. A dinosaur! Oh, almost looks like Gmo bag or something. Is it shoes? I don't know. Ooh. Shoes. You got shoes. shoes. Try them on. Shoes. Wrong foot. Yeah. Wrong foot. <coughs> Thomas, wrong feet. <laughs> Switch feet. Brain <coughs> Scales. Cars. To Thomas. Cars. You already know? Cars. It says cars. 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 Oh, we gotta, we gotta open it. A car. A little predictor. Can you say thank you? Cars. Thomas. Cars. Thomas. Maybe, I don't know. To Thomas from Great Grandma and Grandpa Scales. Cars. <coughs> Here goes the predictor. Is he right? Cars outside, guys. Cars. 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 Julie. This is from Grandma and Grandpa, but it's for Daddy. You've got one eventually, but you, you got to wait your turn. There's no, and there's no particular order. Thomas. Ooh. What's that? Box! Yeah, let, let go, let go. So whatever we have here is Inferno Squad. Yeah. Cool. For on um, the... Uncle Mark and Aunt Jeannie to paper. Thomas. Just rip the paper. Just rip the paper, Thomas. Open! Rip the paper. Okay. Just rip the paper. The paper will rip very, very easily. Hey! You don't need to take the ribbon off. Just rip the paper. There you go. Thomas. What?
What'd you get? Whoa. A car? Car. What's the outfit have on it? Ah, Lego. Look at your shirt, Thomas. Thank you so much, Grandma. Um, we had talked about the sweatshirt this summer, and you remembered, and it's just nice and plain, and you can go with anything. Um, it'll be super comfortable and warm when needed. And um, I just really admired the the cross that you had made, um, or had gotten made, and it's exciting to have one of my own. Daniel and Britt. Thank you guys. Thank you so much for open. thinking open. about us. was it that fell out? Nothing. What is it? The, 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 the cloth, the oh, the what? magic washcloth for the magic towel. You're good. Miss Jingle. Wait, welcome, Jingle. Yeah, we got some shorts. Woohoo! Shorts. We live in basketball shorts here, so thank you, thank you. And the magic towels, What's those that? are so much fun. We're getting this egg open. He and this is this is so funny because he's been on an egg kick lately, and so oh, no, it's up food. No, just, was it not supposed to be silly, open? No, it's silly putty. Oh, it's silly putty. But you gotta keep it in the egg so it doesn't dry out. Christmas again guys. Um, so I hope you enjoyed watching us open some gifts. There was no way I would have been able to show all the gifts and that would have just been too much. I believe, you know, only um, family or a grandmother would be willing to watch how long that took because I think we started around 7 o'clock. We got that around 9.30. So it was a long um, process with three kids and just keeping everybody happy and entertained and teaching Thomas that every gift wasn't for him and um, also keeping our foster kids out of um, the video and the picture and everything. So anyways, we, we would start and then have to stop and start and stop and so there was a lot of that. But we got it done and we, we really enjoyed our kids. Thomas got some cars and he absolutely got dinosaurs 
and he got a little mat to run his cars around. Um, and he got a movie. We're big movie watchers here. Um, Dan got some movies that he loves. He got Legos. And um, yeah, we just got a lot of different things that we love. I um, like to use essential oils, especially if I'm stressed or just tired and things. So my mom got me a new diffuser and some essential oils to go with that. And then um, some fun and quirky things that I asked for. It's my grandma. Or sorry, my mom and dad got me a mini um, marble racer. Something that I can take to school and have on my desk and have them students. Um, not that Bible's ever like boring, right? And then my grandma and grandpa got me this marble pump. And so I just thought it was fun. We went to um, a wooden toy store that was run by an Amish gentleman. this past summer and that's where I saw some of those things and I was like oh this would be fun to have and this would be fun to have and so yeah they got me some of those things and um we got a bunch of other stuff that like I said it took a long time to open our gifts and Thomas is playing and playing and playing and so um yeah it was so much fun we're so so blessed thank you to um all these relatives, friends, family, just, it's because of you guys that we get to feel a little bit of home around Christmas time. And so we truly miss you. Um, I know my mom and my dad and, and um, some of my family are having like snacks and things on Christmas Eve. And just the specialness of that is not lost on me. Like I truly miss it. And so, um, the box with the gifts and, and things, um, does soften that up a little bit and, um, just reminds us how blessed we are. And I'm so thankful for the different people that came together and gave us some money so that we could get gifts for the girls and, yeah. So thank you so much for being a blessing. Um, I hope that you're... Have a wonderful Christmas and remember the reason that we celebrate. Remember that it is um, because of Jesus' birth and that you have just a blessed time with family and friends. God bless. See you next time.